Here's Mark Mitchell, who, like Tyrese Proctor, John Shire thought had his best game of the season against LaSalle. Tyrese Proctor, who is shooting it better recently. Southern Indiana in transition, and Jeremiah Hernandez, who's got a stroke you like. The team in just its second year at the Division I level, coming up from the D2 ranks. Here's Filipowski, who's done such a good job passing out of the post this year. It's one of the big places he's seen improvement since the loss here to Arizona. The talent is always there. This team won't have problems scoring the ball. They just got to defend their rebound and share the ball. A 1995 Division II National Championship team that the current head coach, Stan Gerrard, was on and starred for. Off the miss, it's a rebound for Keyron Powell. Duke's having a tough time early here. They're not matching up. They're getting cross matched up, and they're losing. They're not setting their defense. And it's a Jarvis summoned the ball screen. Not known for his scoring, and left it short. Got his own miss. Backs it out. Here's Smith. Yes, sir. Caleb Foster, Ryan Young, and Sean Stewart are in off the bench for John Shire, and Young turns it over. Here's Jordan Tillman leading the break, one of their top scorers who comes off the bench, averaging double figures, and he is always hunting his shot. Smith off the screen from Nolan Coswell. Six foot 11, fifth year senior, transfer from Tennessee Tech going to work, and he couldn't muscle it over Stewart. Here's the freshman Foster around the young screen. Back for Proctor and post entry. Young defended by Coswell. Backing him down. Loves to go to that right hand and run to the left to score. <laughs> outside in versus yes. inside out. You're okay with the looks, even though it is a lot of shots from three. Right now, I, I, I like it. I just would like to, like to, as long as the ball touches the paint first. You don't want to play just the ball on the perimeter. Because if you see. And it's a scoreless drought of more than three minutes for Duke. Foster on the rip through, had the advantage on Campion. He's been so good coming off the bench with Duke. He's so steady himself. Comes in giving him offense, giving him solid on ball defense as well. Smith around the screen for Moore. And a dribble handoff for Campion. The lefty moves it. Moore hoists it and hits. He jumps out on film. He's just so active and involved on both sides of the ball for these guys. Roach underneath with an answer. And then the turnover, and Jared McCain cashes in. Moves it to Milky. Now the point guard, Campion. 10 to shoot, he's got Mitchell on him. Off the crossover. Bounces for Smith. Oh, that's pretty. Great wow. basketball there. Double penetration, getting in the paint, finding guys on the weak side. Another three-point make. That's five of them now for USI. Filipowski just muscles Coswell. You've been calling for this. Taking it at Coswell again. Got his own miss. Filipowski met by Coswell. Southern Indiana up by 10 on the number nine team in the country. Here's Milky. Can't knock it down. Filipowski another rebound. Dude's lucky there. Milky is the best three-point shooter on the Southern Indiana team. Got a wide open look there. Mitchell slipped it, and Mitchell scores it. Stan Gerard wants a timeout. Sean Stewart got the offensive rebound off the miss at the line, and now Foster slashes, hangs in the air, and missed it. Another offensive rebound spurred by Stewart. Foster goes slashing again. Young cleans it up with another offensive rebound for Duke. Burrowing down low, and he gets the roll. You're going to have to get close to 15 degrees to pull this up to off. And they're halfway there. Proctor driving in the final seconds with a scoop. Much needed for Duke to head to halftime. Tyrese Proctor to the bucket in the waiting seconds. Just a great drive there. It was a lot of the reserves on the floor who got it to within four, playing with Tyrese Proctor as well. Mervis dropped it off, and then Powell had it blocked by Filipowski. Mervis took it back to Hernandez. Off to Jared McCain. Knocks it down, and it's a one-point game. McCain with post entry for Kyle Filipowski. Banging underneath, and a chance at three. And Duke's got the lead. In the first half, second half here, drops it inside, and there's just nobody can guard. They have no one to block the shot. Off Smith and Hernandez have taken some tough ones. Proctor pushes. He kicks. McCain rises. Got it! 
And now has to set up its offense halfway through the shot clock with Mervis directing. Mitchell is the one hounding A.J. Smith. 21, bottom right corner of your screen. Hernandez, much easier this time at the cup. Proctor. Trying to cross up Campion. Roach open to him. Largest lead for Duke. After last season, but decided to return. He's been outstanding for USI. How about the spin from Filipowski? Wow. Great move. Faces him up, so he gets him off his body and just drives and spins on him. In. Old Tyrese Proctor setting it up for Duke. Campion nearly lost it. Has some space and hits another. Maybe he's more comfortable <laughs> out balance. Tyrese Proctor starting to feel it. Campion got a piece of it. Three to shoot. Here's Roach. And he has. 21 in red, A.J. Smith is back into the game after grabbing at that left leg. Foster attacks and scores. By the way, they took off the two points that they had given to Jack Campion. And they ruled that there was no basket interference. And so we ping pong on that potential two points. And instead of 44, it's 42. And then three more, Javius Moore with his second triple. Stewart can guard all sorts of positions for you. Shot clock at seven. He shuts off Campion again. Moore on the baseline. L. Smith, Moore, and Hernandez, the five out there for Stan Girard and Southern Indiana. Here's Moore. Oh, it's going up. <laughs> Ty, Filipowski get whatever he wants. Moore finds Powell just back into the game. And what they call blue, which is like hedge and yes. touch a little bit, but it's not a, a super hard hedge. Right. Just so he can recover. Because for one, they have rebound concerns. Roach sets the screen, then was trying to get it. Instead, Filipowski spinning and banging and hitting off glass. Yeah, there, there's, Powell is just too small for him. He, once he gets an angle, he can't affect Filipowski's shot. 19 and 13 for Kyle Filipowski. Powell couldn't corral it. Filipowski has it picked. Hernandez lays it in. Fine guys and, and, and really good passers, and that's better than the guy with the ball in his hand. Proctor, pick and roll. So smooth. That's what we're talking about. But Duke's got an 80-62 win, and the Blue Devils are 5-1 headed to Fanville. Got to be pleased if you shower with the, the way your team responded coming out of the second half.